What is up you guys? We are back here at Universal Studios. It's been over five years, Becky, since we have been here. I am excited, look behind us. There's the big Universal ball right there. But if we turn, if we turn, we have a red carpet entrance just waiting for us, really. It's there all year round. But we are here for Taste of Universal. We are excited. They have a ton of different foods here. Lots of food. And we have not been in here since they put up or created or built or whatever anything, you want to call it. Did anything. It's been five years. It's been a long time since we've been here. And they haven't done Wizarding World of Harry Potter. This is going to be the first time we see it. We're excited. We can't wait. I can't wait to see Minions Land and Springfield. And I'm just excited to be here at Universal. So let's get I in there. I can't wait to drink butter beer. Let's go get a butter beer. Woo! We have made it into Universal. You can see behind me. Look behind me. You can see behind me there is the entrance and here we are in Universal Studios Hollywood for the first time in forever you guys it's been a long time I'm excited a lot of loud music going on behind here but look at the first prop is the minion that's right back there and then the Harry Potter car right here right here my mask Harry Potter car right there this is remember when they drove the car the flying car they made it a flying car and they drove it and it crashed into the tree over there at Hogwarts oh okay this is that yeah this is the Ford right here you guys Man, and it's beat up too. It's like, it's got, who's that? Is that Harry Potter right behind him? Oh my goodness. I'm excited. And then, oh my goodness, you guys, look at, they got the mummy car. I am a big fan of the mummy movies. I don't know about you guys. You guys out there, leave a comment down below if you guys are a big fan of the mummy movies. But look at this bad boy right here. I am loving that. I just love what it looks like. So Awesome, what a great photo opportunity. So cool. Then they have the map right here for Taste Universal, all the different food offerings. Oh, they got crusty burgers. I want to go to three broomsticks. Uh, broomsticks. I want to get me a butter beer. I want to get me some donuts. I want to go to Mel's Diner. I want to do it all, you guys. Holy moly, cockatoli. This is some loud music, but we got Kiko in the house. What What's happening, man? What do? Are you ready for a good time? Yes, 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 we are. Oh, wonderful! In for the hug. Is that the best welcome got ever? Got the steal. Yeah, I'm so excited. And he's in a dancing. You're in a dancing mood. You're going to be dancing all night tonight, Juan, aren't you? Woo! Oh, getting down. Oh, oh, right. Yeah, baby. Oh, oh. Hey, when we get our Sprinter van, yeah. we should paint it like the mystery machine. No, the, the whole point is to be stealth, not to stand out like this. That would be hilarious. We are over here at Minion Land. I, I don't know, there's a door right here, and there's a doorbell right here. Hello, Universal! When I wake up in the morning, love. He's singing to me. Yeah. Woo. Let's see who's let's see who's next door. We got the whole place to ourselves. It's like VIP treatment at Universal Studios all by ourselves. Nobody else is here. Let's see who's home. Hit this one. Woo! The biggest live here! Let's see who lives at door number three. Here we go. Door number three. More minions. We own this street, babe. This is our street. This is our street. I love it. Babe, our first stop today is going to be going into Hogsmeade. Please respect the spell limits. Don't, ah! don't put any spells on anybody you're not supposed to. Don't do any spells you're not supposed to. I am casting spells left and this is, right. Actually, I'm really excited because I hear the food is really good and it's going to be our first time ever trying a butter beer. Yes. Oh, that's going to be our first thing? Yes. Thank you, Carrie, and thank you, Rosa. This butter beer is, is on. Awesome. You. We are entering, you guys, Hogmeade for the very, very first time. 
Look at this, this is amazing. Look at this train right here. This is the train that brought Harry Potter to Hogwarts for the first time ever. Look at it, it's here. Hogwarts Express 5972. Oh my goodness. And you gotta have the cages for the owls and everything. Oh my gosh, this makes me so excited. I cannot wait to go to Universal Orlando in October when all the rides are open. So much super duper fun. That is awesome or what? Isn't that amazing? That is crazy. Like, I love that. Like we finally figured out where cotton candy comes from. It comes from this person's hair. What? There's the butterbeer car right there in front of us, you guys. We are going to get a butterbeer quick. I am so sorry. I am super hyper because I am super excited and like I want to go eat and get butterbeer, but I'm so excited and overwhelmed with how amazing it is here that Josh cannot retain my attention enough to get me in to go get some food and some drinks. So we're going to try to do that now. For the first meal, you guys, we are coming to three broomsticks right here. They, we've never been in here before. I'm excited. They have fish and chips, shepherd pie, turkey leg. They have all sorts of goodness in here. And we get to be joined by Juan. I'm so excited. Super excited. I can't wait to try this stuff here, you guys. But I think first, I think we have to try the butterbeer. Have butter to beer. try the butterbeers. Have to do the so, butterbeer first. Can I, take, can I take this? You, she ordered the hot one. So we're gonna taste both of them. I ordered the frozen one. And I'm gonna try to get a brain freeze. Okay, let's see. Good. That's I like my jam. That's my jam. That's I like my butterscotch, jam. though. I, I want to mix it a little bit. I want to mix it in a little bit. That is super good. This is ooh, it's like a butterscotch yeah. candy. Yeah, it's like oh my god. Ooh, that is amazing. Let me try the warm. Oh my. Okay, I gotta stop myself because I'm gonna brain freeze myself right now. Oh, this is my jam. Let me try. Let me try. Oh my god, I think yeah, I like the hot one better. Oh my gosh, it's oh like it's like a caramel goodnessy, deliciousy, yummyish. Okay, I'm gonna give it back to you because otherwise I'm gonna drink the whole thing. Oh my gosh, I would love to pour some of this into my coffee. I have to say, for the first time ever having a butter beer, I, I it's think amazing. I'm going for the hot one. I do like the cold one, but um, that hot one, it just warms well, you know my what tummy it, up. Well, you know what it is because it's a little cold outside. So that's amazing during a hot day. Let me taste it I again. If I... Let me taste it again. Let me see. Oh yeah. You know, you know what I like to do? You know what I like to do? I like to take a drink of the cold one and then wash it down with the warm one so I don't get the brain freeze. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. This is amazing for a hot day, but it is cool outside. And so I'm really happy that I chose the warm one. Yeah. Oh, it's so good. Next on our list of things here is the fish and chips. I hear great stories about this. The fish and chips have a little lime, lemon, and they got some tartar sauce and obviously fish and chips. So I hear that it's really delicious. And I love that the chips are nice and thick. Yes. Are they cold though? Uh-uh, ooh, they're warm. You can taste it? like the beer. Here we go. Here we go. These are, tartar sauce. These are good fish and chips. You can oh. taste like beer. You know, like a beer batter. Man, those are smooth. This smooth. is really good. It's just good. tender and flaky. Like, it, it, look at look at you guys. It's like a, it's like it should be. It's very flaky. You can see the steam coming off of it. Oh man. Yeah, okay, that's delicious. And even the tartar sauce is good. I'm impressed. If this is how the rest of the event's gonna go, it's gonna be deliciously amazing. I'm hoping we're gonna get the best first. Well, I think we probably did though. I bet you this is the best. We are gonna dive right into this shepherd's pie, you guys. I mean, it looks really good. They got a nice crisp on the mashed and potatoes the top is on potatoes, top. potatoes, right? Yeah, it's like a crisp on the mashed potatoes. Okay, let me get this part. And then you gotta, you gotta dig in though. You gotta dig in. Look at, look at, look at, look at, look at you guys. You gotta dig in. You gotta get everything, all the goodness that's in there. Ooh. Oh, that's gonna be hot. Ooh. That's gonna be hot. That looks good. One carrot down. I didn't get very much meat. Okay. Hilarious thing? Yeah. I normally don't like shepherd's pie. Yeah. Because it's gross. It's too strong. This is delicious. This is really good, right? Like, I love how they crisp the mashed potatoes on the top, and then all the goodness is hidden. You know what it tastes once like? We get to, 
I'm gonna show you guys. You know why? You know what it tastes like? It tastes like the the ground beef kiesel that I made. Mm-hmm. Okay. So you gotta go in there, in there. Deep down in there, there is goodness happening. I don't want to spill it. This tastes like my geesel. Yeah. Okay, what did you think of our first food here Amazing. at Tasty Universal? It, it, it really exceeded my expectations. Yeah. I didn't think it was going to be good. And then I heard people say that the butter beer was not good. It's not and, really. then, and then I heard people say that it was good, but then some people are like, oh, the butter beer is horrible. I found the butter beer to be amazing. I love the butter beer. I because I love butterscotch. So and I'm super glad that I got it warm and not cold. Yeah. But the fish and chips were really good. You can taste the beer in the beer batter. And not only could you taste the beer in the beer batter, but that shepherd's pie is probably the best shepherd pie that I've had. It was more to my liking versus the other ones that I've tasted in the past. So I agree, it was super delicious. I give it two thumbs up already. I cannot wait to check out the rest of the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Yeah, I call it the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, but it really, this is Hogsmeade. Now you have to be patient with me because I want to go in the store and they want to go in the stores. And I want to follow you in the store. We got all day, babe. Uh -huh. What is it, in there? Stirring and stirring. Oh, look at it. it is stirring. Stirring and stirring. I just like how they have these little back alleys here and, and how the look at it's just you feel like like I feel like I'm in a town and I'm gonna see some some wizard somewhere. Oh there's my first wizard sighting. Wee 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 This is just amazing you guys. Look at this. Look at this castle, babe. Look at this. This is crazy. Like I love it. Live here? Can you what? Can I live here? I love it here. No, you cannot. Live I don't want to leave. Where, where are you gonna sleep? In, In that big castle. giant castle up there? Easy. Look at this. It's so cool. Squid it. Trying oh, to escape. Oh my God! It's flying above us. What? Grab it. Grab it. I can't. I can't get it. Seriously though, this place is amazing. It is really cool. I am. I am it. so happy. Don't you wish you would have listened to me and got annual passes? Uh, we will, maybe this next year. Huh? I, I love it. I love the trees. So beautiful. I can't wait to see it at night. Oh, you know, we're at Becky here, so we're back in the store again. Ooh. I have a real one. Look, at, do right? you see the, the cages? With What's this, the, the little cages up there, the poles. Everything is done Whoa, so we should, well. We should get an ornament for each of us. You get Slytherin because you're Slytherin. I'm Slytherin. Why am I Slytherin? Because you're Slytherin. Why? I'm Gryffindor. Jessica. This is Slytherin. I think Jessica's Gryffindor too. Who's Hufflepuff? Is Mario Hufflepuff? I'm a Hufflepuff. No, you're Slytherin. I don't even know what a Pufflepuff is. I'm, I'm Pufflepuff. <laughs> you don't know what a Pufflepuff is? Like this is you. You're the sneaky, sneaky. I am like oh, the most no. nice, friendly guy ever. How am I a sneaky, sneaky? Slytherins are cunning. I think cunning. I'm this. What is yeah, this? Yeah, you're cunning and crafty. What is this right here? That's me, Gryffindor. What is a Hufflepuff? Hufflepuff is a smart. There's a bird. And there's. I want to be no, this no, guy. No, right here. Okay. Got all sorts of socks. Everyone's in on their sock okay, game. Okay, you get. I get this one. I want to be a Hufflepuff though. You could be a Hufflepuff. You have to take, you have to take they the, seem like nice and friendly and goofy. You have to take the you have to take the test to know who you are. What does it say? I serve time in Oh man. Maybe you probably have. These are really cool. They're 50% off. Look at I can get my my how much, are, house. how much is 50% off of what? Um 27. Okay. So about 15. Look at one. We can all get our fifteen dollars basically. 15 off. Fourteen dollars a month. And then we'll drink beer out of them. Look. I'm Hufflepuff. You don't know if you're you Hufflepuff. Know. You have to take the test. I know, but I want to be. I want to be a Hufflepuff. What's the test thing? Do you know where to take? It's it's a, we're not doing it right now. Phone. We're not doing yeah. it right now. Right I'm, now. I'm gonna live right my now. lie of a life as a Hufflepuff. What He's so cute. He's so cute. He's so cute. It's a honey badger. Because I'm sweet like honey. No. Cunning like a badger. No, you sweet like Tennessee whiskey, honey. <laughs> Baby, you, can get, you can't have a wand. You I, don't I need a wand. A wand. I, I don't need you casting no spells on me. I already have my little brewing. I need a fancy, wand. Fancy, all these fancy, fancy wands. But if you're really going to get a wand, you have to go to the wand yes, store. The wand store. Yeah. Look, I have to give you a Hufflepuff cup. Look, you're not even a Hufflepuff. 
Yeah, I think I'm a Hufflepuff. Why would you say I'm not? Why would you think that I'm not? Because you don't know what you are. You can't just say you're a Hufflepuff and not take the test. I can say I'm whatever no. I want to be. No. Juan's a Slytherin. Yeah. I'm the colors of the Hufflepuff are all about me too. But I just can't get over how awesome this place is. Like it is so killer. It, it is, is amazing. Amazing. Just look at it, you guys. Just look. I feel like I really feel like I'm walking through Hogsmeade. Babe, I feel my sweet tooth is rattling right now. It is getting excited. What is that? It's a it's a potion, sweet treats. Ooh. You know I'm gonna have to get all three of the girls something from here. Okay. Well, you might want to get them from Minion Land too. They have stores over there. They oh, want true, Minion true, stuff. True. No, Chanel isn't too Harry Potter. Right Chanel now. is all about the Harry Potter. Look, I remember these things. Chocolate frogs. They got chocolate covered frogs. Chocolate covered frogs. You like frogs? I love frogs. And you like to eat them? I do. Man, they got a lot of cool stuff over here, you guys. I think this is the pink room. What is this? Crazy good funness happy. Oh, look at this. There's a fluffy. There's a fluffy. That's what I'm saying. They look like they just want, you just want to hug. You want to hug them, right? You, you just want to squishy squish them. Next on our list, Becky, is Springfield. We grew up watching The Simpsons, and so now we get to relive it by coming into Springfield and just looking at all this crazy. I want to go to Camp Krusty. Yeah. You want to go to the Krusty's? Ooh, we're going to get a burger over at Krusty Burger. Oh, I cannot wait to get my donut over at Larla Donuts. Look at that. Oh, I'm going to get me a big Larla Donut later. Babe, I can't wait for my donuts. We got ice cream parlors and pizzas and hot dogs and crusty burgers right here. Oh man, the best Duff beer ever. Look at this, I love how they make the platters like a Duff beer. That is so creepy yet so cool. I think this is me after a few Duff beers. You, you get, get, you get, I edgy, get edgy and I get dizzy. Yeah, I get edgy. You're edgy for sure. You guys, are we going to the lower lot? No, I don't think we can go all the way down to the very bottom lower lot, but I believe we can go down one escalator just so we can check out Becky Nintendo World. Or the construction thereof. This is crazy. We are riding down the escalator for a scenic photo op. Baby, they just say it's a scenic photo op. They didn't say you can go to the lower, lower level, but there's some pretty good scenery from I, this I little... I like the scenic off anyway. Yeah. Um, I just like to look out at everything, you know, how I am. One of the weirdest features about this place is that it has two levels, so you have to take literally three escalators to get to the lower level. Now, they're not letting us all the way down there. They're letting us right where we're at right here, but let me show you the views that we have. Look at these views, you guys. Like, if I come over here, we could see Jurassic World, the ride is right down there. And then the back lot, the studio tour will take you down this road right here into the Hollywood back lot area. And there's the lower lot over there. But then if you come over here, look at this beautiful, beautiful view that you get. I actually just want to go play golf on that golf course because it's a private membership only golf course. Very high end, very fancy, but I love to go there. But yeah, you got all these like, look at those are, they shoot TV shows and movies and stuff. And all of these buildings down there. So look right there, you guys, there's sets down there. You can see the fake building fronts and everything. That is the universal back lot. But when you're taking the tour, it seems so much bigger than it really is, but it's just a, it's a, it's a pretty large lot, but it seems so much bigger when you're taking the tram tour. Look at this. There it is, Nintendo World right there, you guys. Under construction, being built. And then if we come back over here, Right down there at the bottom, that's the entrance, the pipe to get into what's her name's castle. I don't even know her name, I can't even think of it right now. That is super cool. The ride building is right back behind it. That's gonna be your go kart ride, and then I know there's like a Yoshi ride floating around on the top of one of those areas over there. I don't know exactly where, but can't believe it. It's right there, you guys. It is happening just like that. We're going back up to the top floor. Go get us a crusty burger. Ooh, 
We made it back up. We're here at Moe's. Can we get a drink at Moe's? Or we just can't get the food? Flaming Moe. Well, you can get yourself a Blue Moon at Angry Orchard or a Duff Beer. I'm like, let's get a Krusty Burger. She's like, I want a foot line with chili. So we're going to half the burger and half the hot dog? That's a lot of food. Think we can handle it? Think we can do it? I think we can do it. And a libation? And a libation. Ah. Maybe uh, the adult sort? Yeah, not another. If not, we'll just get the regular one. No big deal. Alright, let's do this. We had the funniest off-camera moment. Tell them how you started the conversation. So, I, we, we first we said that our trips are so expensive because of all the beers and alcohol we drink when we come to the theme parks. But then I was like, ooh, they have Modelo. I'm gonna get Modelo. She goes, me too. And then she goes, you wanna share it? And I was like, what? what are, are you even, talking about? Are you even part of Midlife Five? Share it? <laughs> no, we gotta get our own, silly. Y'all know how we do. That's when the vlogs start getting real. <laughs> We finally got some food from Krusty Burger. We got some goodness. What did we get, Becky? Ooh, we got the Krusty Burger and then we got the, I don't know what it's called, foot long chili cheese dog. Was that Joe's foot long? Was it Joe's or Moe's? Moe's foot long and we got michiladas. I told Josh, I haven't drank out of a can in a long time, let alone drank a tall boy or a tall can. I just feel like somebody needs to give me a paper bag now. Like, are you gonna be able to hang? I'm so grown up now. I need a glass. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, right. I can't wink. drink. I, wink, I wink. can't drink it without a glass. <laughs> I don't know. Now I'm looking at the Krusty Burger and I'm like, I'm not too impressed. But it all depends on the flavor, right? The bun's kind of crunchy already. Nice and crunchy. It's toasty. It's toasty. Um. I can't wait for, let me just say this. I can't wait for the chili dog. That's what I can't wait for. Because this is kind of uh, mediocre. You gotta add some sauce. Well, friend, it comes with it in there. That might have been the smart move though to put the sauce on the top like that for every bite. I love it. It tastes like a smart and final patty. I'm gonna say it's not like a habit burger. But it's good. The sauce is tasty with the the bun is like like nice and toasty on the outside. That's a good burger. Ooh, this is what I'm talking about. A, I love Nathan dogs and they put so I much. I thought this was a uh, show Bob's. It is, but it has a Nathan's hot dog. But look at all this cheese and yummy chilliness and onions. Oh, it's got to be better than the burger for sure. Oh, man. Dang, girl. Mm. It just looks delicious. I mean, just, just eat that thing. It just looks so good. Now I have a crusty burger. Wait, no. This is a side show Bob's hot dog, chili dog, best thing ever. And it was a foot long. We split it three ways. Then that, still, I got a big old giant one here. Here we go. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. Mm. Oh yeah. The yeah, onions right? in there, the cheese and the chili, it's just like the perfect blend of chili. Uh, that's really good. And they grated the cheese with the thin grating. The hot dog, the chili dog, Sideshow Bob's is way better than the burger by far. If you come here, I understand you're gonna get the burger, but you must get the Sideshow Bob foot long chili dog. Split it with your friends, it's huge. You found a new best friend. Look at your boy, what? He's getting buzz. He's got buzz cola. Oh wait, you're buzz too. <laughs> We're about to head into the Quickie Mart, which is one of my favorite places in Springfield. It's where a lot of people are getting their fresh donuts right here. We're gonna get those a little bit later. You want a big giant can of Duff? Oh my goodness. Look at that's cute. Here, don't let Juan drink one of those. He'll be done after one time. Are in there. That's the, oh, for your beer. Oh. Look. The beer goes in here. So you put it on. And it has a oh, cooler. You can't take it off. It has a cooler. Yeah. Oh, it's cooler? A coaster. Oh, it is. That's pretty cool. Got some Duff underwear, too, for all of you really hardcore beer drinkers. Oh, no, for Tuesday nights. Uh-oh. 
They're only eight ninety five. You find your Zen piece, Becky, and uh, who would have thought you'd find your Zen I piece? I can't. I need Bart. I need Bart on here because. Oh, there's no Bart there. Just Tiffany, Jessica. I need Andrew oh, yeah. for the Christmas tree since we have all the Starbucks on there. Oh, all yeah. right. Now we have a Duff beer. You get it. That would be That's so cute. cute. Another thing for the studio, we can have Duff beer pillows for the studio. Oh, I like it. Right. Right one? You can be like, oh, look at me. Josh, you need this for your ball hair. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. My belly's not that big anymore. I went on a diet and got rid of that thing. Oh my gosh, keep us away from here. There's shot glasses all over the place here. This whole thing's got shot glasses on it. Best vacation ever. I like this shirt, you guys. This is cool. And this is a t-shirt, but it makes you look like you work at the Quickie Mart. Guys, this is a true statement. Beer. Now there's a temporary solution. You think they'd clean up their trash cans a little bit around here? Man. It's okay. El Barto was here. I wish Cletus's chicken shack was open today, but no go. I hear the chicken is to die for. I think this guy has an idea. He wants to get out and eat some of that taste of universal food because he don't like the police food. He don't like your food, guys. He wants some taste of universal food. Hey, you're looking in the wrong direction. He's up there, brother. What are you looking over there for? I miss the studio back a lot. I cannot wait to go there one day again. But the studio tour, they let us walk a little bit farther down than I think we thought we could. So we're gonna go check it out. They're letting us walk all the way across the bridge. You can come all the way down to the other side here. It's a closer look at the back lot right there. You see the back side of a fake building. Pretty awesome, and over there was where the Jaws attraction was at, the water feature there. Man, El Bartos everywhere. He tagged up this popcorn booth. You better watch out. They got people escaping all over the place here to get this food at Tasty Universal. Look at this guy. They saw the donut guy, and they're like, oh, we see donuts. Donuts, donuts. So I'll tell you, don't drink and drive, or don't eat donuts and drive, you guys. We have made it to Minion Land and we are going into the Minion Cafe to get ourselves some Minion Nachos and I think a dessert too. I am loving the way this looks in here. This is super awesome. I love the centerpiece. I am loving the way it smells in here. It smells like chili cheese fries or something. So I'm excited about these nachos because I heard that they were actually good. What kind of nachos are they? They're chicken nachos. They have guac, they have a pico de gallo and they have a guac a guacamole, onions, pico de gallo, and it looks like they have a cheese on there. So let me just try. But you know what? They're like those tostito uh, chips, so they're very flaky. They're not um, strong. Strong chips. They're very. They break real easy. So I'm just trying to cut a piece of this chicken to get on there. Okay, here we go. Are they good? They're just cold, so they must have been sitting there a while. Uh, I hate when that happens. So the cheese isn't hot and neither is the chicken, but it's tasty. Let me try some. I think if it was hot, it would be better. Oh, baby. Can I get this in one bite? Big bite. You got it, you got it. Oh, get it, 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 woo! I'm not wasting anything. Flavors are good. But they, well, chicken's not cold for my piece. But you know, you have the guac, which is chilled, which is nice to have and stuff, but I mean, that's pretty good. Actually, that's not bad at all. I like that. Life's going nowhere. Oh, are you spilling the tea? The universal that's tea. That's like make, the makey bunch. Right there. What? Give it a little kiss. I know. Get the, the mini okay, kiss. break into that. No, no, I have to eat that too. Oh, <laughs> Becky. Becky. Okay, ready? Is this oh. hard? This is hard. Don't eat that. That's fun then. Yeah. Okay, got a little bit of everything. There we go. Happy birthday, friend. Is that good? Delicious or what? Am I gonna like that? I hope I'm not. Yes, as soon as I put a spoon in my mouth, I could taste the banana. Oh. So it was delicious. I can't wait to try it. Let me try something. I say yes. No, it's mine. Oh, you know I love banana. Uh. Right? Oh, yeah. The best thing I've had so far, I think. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. Yeah, yeah. That butterbeer was pretty freaking oh, awesome. Oh, no, 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 the, yeah, okay, you're right, butterbeer. Oh. Crusty burger was the best thing. No. <laughs> Stop it. Eat that. I dare you. All of it. Oh, I got the eye of the tiger, I thrill of the fight. 
Why are you so nasty, dude? Why are you so gross? I, I love it. I don't get them. It's actually pretty good. But what I do like about the event is there's like fewer food choices. So you don't feel like you're in a hurry to try to taste and eat everything. It's just the right amount of food choices to be able to relax because they're they're um, big portions. It's a huge portion. Yeah. So it gives you time to just relax and enjoy the day. We've sat a lot just hanging out with our friends. We'll meet up with Juan. We met up. And we still have three hours to go. Yeah. We've just got to sit with our friends and eat and drink and then split up and and just enjoy the day. So it's really, really nice. That's one thing. It, it feels more laid back. It even feels like a slower, more laid back pace than Knott's Berry Farm. Yeah, definitely. It's, it's definitely mellow. The crowd levels are small. I mean, it's just a great event overall. You know, Universal's not a huge park, but you know what? It feels like there's a lot to do, a lot to eat. There's a lot to see, especially for us who haven't been here for a long time. So I am enjoying it. Okay, so I got a salad and a crepe. It's a spinach and strawberry crepe salad with feta cheese. Uh, I think it's uh, purple onions. It has almonds. So it looked delicious when I saw it made, so I ordered yeah. one. I love spinach, I love feta, and I love strawberries I know, together with balsamic vinaigrette. Let's see. So it's a salad wrap. It's a salad wrap. It's a savory It's a savory wrap. It's a salad and a crepe. I like it. Is it good? It looks good. Prove it. Take another bite. It's delicious to me. I don't know why I would eat that. <laughs> <laughs> I get this leg, you get that leg. Well, you're you get definitely this arm, getting you get that arm. definitely getting that side because you slobbered on it. Oh so. yes, I'm gonna throw up a picture, you guys. I'll throw up a picture. We just took of that. And I, was I think I'm gonna start with the thing. middle. I mean, but I don't know if it's even safe for me to eat Turkey this after the way you were driving with it. <laughs> turkey leg. <laughs> you're crazy. It does look like a turkey leg. You want mustard with it, or are you gonna try it plain first? No, I always like, I'm going to try it plain and okay. then I'll get mustard. It's not bad plain. Not bad plain. Mmm. It's a good pretzel. It's, it's buttery. It's a good pretzel. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't wait for that. I want a piece. I see Carla looking over here. She looks oh, good. Look, look it's at it. It's crunchy on the outside and soft on the inside. I like that a lot. Actually, that's really, really good. Yeah, I'm loving that pretzel. That's a good way for us to, I think, finish the food portion. Oh, no, wait. We might have to get one more dessert. I don't know. We might finish with this. I'm not 100% sure. It's so good, I don't want to ruin this goodness with something else that might not be as good. Oh my gosh, we made it into, or Ollivanders, is that the name of it? I am in the one shop, look at it. Oh, these ones. This is freaking amazing. That is crazy. Look at, I like how it looks old with all the stains. On the ceiling and everything. Look at it, all the ones. Oh, look at it, you can pick, you pick right out from the thing. You pick wands. You're supposed to try to find what one. No, I know which one I am because I took the test. I'm pine. You're what? Pine. I, I need a pine with unicorn. I don't see pine. I see different. No, these ones wands don't there. have it. So many wands here. <gasps> oh, so cute! Look at. You don't need to take it out right here. You can just. Let me see. Oh, that is pretty. I like that one better than the other one, actually. Can I have one, babe? You can do whatever you want to do. Can I really? Whatever you say. No, seriously. Or seriously. I love I you. Oh my god, I'm so happy. She got a wand, you guys. She is super duper excited if you about guys having see a wand. Me without my mask, <laughs> I didn't smile. Even think I was gonna get a wand. Now, what are you gonna do with that wand? I'm gonna cherish it. Cherish it forever, forever. and ever and I got ever. Hermione's because mine said I should have like a pine wand. And um, the only one that they had the pine with the unicorn was the interactive ones. And uh -huh. I didn't need an interactive one. So the yeah. closest to it was the Hermione's one, which I love Hermione. Uh -huh. Look at how cute my wand is, you guys. Super duper. I'm so excited. Super duper Thank cute. Thank you so much. I didn't think I was going to get a wand. Ah, you got a wand. And with that, you guys, that is our trip to Taste of Universal. Becky is super happy because she got a wand now. I have to say though, all the food was good. I wasn't a big fan of the Krusty Burger, but everything else was super delicious. Yes. Especially the food here in Hogsmeade. Oh my God, a three brooms. Yes. Broomsticks, I think it's called. 
That was great. Total butterbeer fan. And the pretzel was delicious. The big giant pretzel that's bigger than both our heads put together. Butterbeer for life. I am sold on butterbeer now forever. Yes. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you haven't done so already, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you next time.